Hello everybody, I'm Jackie K. Cooper here with Amber Howell. And this is Tell All Tuesday. It is, once again. And you know, it's like show and tell. Show and tell. I have no idea what he's about to show and tell us. All right. Can you see this? Mm -hmm. This is like the one sheet for a movie. Yeah, like a poster. Yes. And this movie is Umbrellas of Cherbourg. Okay. Have I ever talked to you about this? No. Okay. When it's funny because t I did an interview today with a guy named Kelly Blatz. Okay. And he is an actor, director, writer. Oh my gosh, he has so many hats. And I was interviewing him about a movie that's on Amazon Prime called One Fast Move, which I really enjoyed. And during our conversation, he said, what is your favorite movie? Mm -hmm. you know, and I've given like a million answers to that because it depends on what day it right. is, you know, whatever. But <clears throat> last week was my birthday. That's right. And my oldest son, JJ, sent me this. Uh -huh. And what was amazing is it's a perfect gift for me. But I had talked about the Umbrellas of Cherbourg, mm -hmm. but I didn't think JJ was listening. Mm -hmm. But he was. And here he is all these years later Sending me this. Sending me this. How thoughtful. But I was telling Kelly Blatz, when I grew up in Clinton, South Carolina, population 10,000, <laughs> I went to Erskine College in a town known as Due West, South Carolina. Never heard of it. Population maybe 800. Uh -huh. So I had never been exposed to foreign film. Mm -hmm. So I went to law school in Columbia, South Carolina, uh -huh. which was a metropolis compared to everything else. <laughs> I had an apartment, and it was right near an intersect group intersection called Five Points. Like Atlanta has Five Points, uh -huh. Columbia had Five Points, and it was where different. It wasn't downtown. It was where you know different stores were, and they had a fine arts theater, mm -hmm. and. One day, I was driving through Five Points, and this was on the marquee, uh -huh. and I thought, I wonder what that is, uh -huh. and I went to see it, and Amber, it just opened up a whole new world to me. Because it's French. It's French. Right. It's, yeah. I'd never seen a foreign film. Right. It's French. It's an opera. The entire thing is sung. I, maybe I'm getting this wrong, but don't you, do you like musicals? Yes. You do like musicals. Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. But this just opened up a whole world of cinema mm -hmm. that I'd never been exposed that you to. Never knew existed. No, I didn't know it existed. And I went back to class law school the next day and I said, Has anybody seen this Umbrellas of Cherbourg? Mm. And they're like, Huh? Yeah. What? And that was one reason I got into reviewing movies was to expose people. To, to things that they would not normally see. Right. And so I've got the DVD to the Umbrellas of Cherbourg. I've got the album to the Umbrellas of Cherbourg. Uh -huh. It's just fantastic. But JJ, remembering that. From all that time all ago. All that time of, of me talking about and sending me this. That's very I thoughtful. I'm going to hold uh -huh. it up this way. Yeah. Everything's in French on it, you know, La Parole de Chambourg or whatever it is. Very thoughtful. Where are you going to hang it? I don't know. We've got to find a really special place yeah. for it. Got to find but a I don't know who spot. this guy is that, in it, but this is Catherine Deneuve. And How she long is still ago? an actress. Okay. She's still acting. Okay. Yeah. Cool. But, That's uh, very thoughtful. This okay. was in 63. Okay. Whoa. Way before I was even born. Wow. That may have been way before your parents were born. It, it was. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> but, but it was so funny, though, to be talking to Kelly, and you know, he asked that, and I had just gotten this, and by the way, I want to say you were sweet enough to put some up on Instagram about my birthday, and I was just overwhelmed by the wish, good wishes and support, and I appreciate it, appreciate it, appreciate it. Yeah, that's that, they were very kind on that post. Uh, they were, so were they people. not? Oh yeah. my gosh, they were yeah. so nice. So I read them all. I, you know, I, you and I are both alike. 
I mean, I think we're both meticulous, uh -huh. but I have to make sure that everybody Everything gets the like, heart. I will go and double check. I'll check behind you and make sure I'm that serious. you like I, them you all. Know, because I got emails, you know, straight mm -hmm. to me. I got stuff Text. on YouTube. I got stuff. Facebook. Facebook. Yeah. Yeah. And I was just, I thought, oh, if I miss just so one popular. heart. No, if I miss one heart and somebody thinks, man, he didn't even. He didn't like me. They liked it, you know. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was terrible. Well, when you're just so popular, popular, you popular. just you, it's hard to keep up. Yeah, you know. But I, I want y'all to watch this Kelly Blatt's interview because, like I said, he directed this movie, wrote the movie, didn't star in it. He's an actor, but he didn't star in it. But it is just so interesting. Oh, I'm jumping like mad. But when I said that this was my, he said. I said, it was the first film I'd ever seen in French, you know, and he said, my wife is French. He said, she'll just love the fact that you love that movie. That's so he wrote fun. me recent, right after the interview, and he said, my wife was so happy to hear yeah. you like that movie. Yeah. What's his name again? Kelly Blatz. Kelly Blatz. And the movie is is one fast movie, and it's on Amazon Prime. Okay. You should watch should it. Should I watch it? Yeah. Okay. It's a, it's a relationship movie. When I have some time. You know, you ever never apparently. All right, before we run out of time, I want I don't I know you don't give all the details, okay, but okay. just give highlights. Okay, of your weekend. Let me just give everyone a recap of what happened to me and my husband over the weekend. We drove to St. Louis for one of my very good friends, St. Louis. Yeah, it was like a 12 hour drive total, 12 hour drive. Yeah. And um, I had a very good friend who was getting married, which love her, love to see her and her husband and her family. They're so lovely, et cetera. Love them all. Um, but we just had the most unfortunate experience getting there and leaving that place. I was thinking, they, they went on my birthday, mm -hmm. Friday the 13th. Oh, it makes so much more sense now. <laughs> it makes more sense. I guess I should tell them why it was so bad though, right? But she told me this after we take last week's show, and I'm thinking, don't go, Amber. Yeah. That 12 hours, that the remnants of the hurricane were still yeah. being felt. Yeah. And it was just, a, it was destined to be unfortunate, honestly. And you were leaving on Friday. The wedding was on Saturday. Coming home Y'all were coming home on Sunday. Quick trip. And I thought, well, they'll probably get up at four o'clock in the morning to go. And then you texted me and said, it's your birthday. Yep. And I, and I said, how far are you? And you said, oh, we Atlanta. haven't gotten to Atlanta yet. I think I called you yeah, and it you was like, call me. You it call was me. like 10 in the morning, yeah. nine or 10 in the morning. Said, or just We're in not Atlanta. To Atlanta no. And I thought, oh my gosh, they still got 50 states to go through. No, seriously. We, just a, a very brief summary of what happened. Terrible traffic all the way there. Atlanta, Chattanooga, Nashville. You hit three huge cities on the way. Terrible traffic. All right, after you pass through Nashville, mm -hmm. is there any big city between that and no. St. Louis? No. Just is there a state between Tennessee and... Kentucky. Oh, you hit all that, that too. Okay. Georgia, Tennessee, Kentucky, Illinois, then St. Louis. That's, that's the way you go from where we live. And just terrible traffic until we got to Kentucky. And then I realized that I did not pack the dress that I was going to wear to this wedding. So on Saturday, we had to go and get me a dress to wear to this wedding. Um, we got the start time of the ceremony wrong. So we were going to be like- I love the way you're saying we. We, we. <laughs> I put the blame on both of us. It's probably There's my fault. Cody, if you're watching this, I can hear you going, not me. No, not me. Cody is so I good. I didn't forget the dress. No. I didn't know, she said the time, no. she told me. Cody. I was just the driver. He was just the driver. <laughs> but the thing is, he's such a good planner and it's honestly my fault. <laughs> Everything is honestly my fault. But what wasn't my fault was when we were leaving the wedding, we noticed that our car's tire pressure back left was going down, 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 down into the danger zone. And um, we, 
realized that we were going to wake up with a flat tire on that Sunday morning, and sure enough, we did. I bet that was a good night's sleep. It, like, I'm going to wake up in the morning, that tire's going to be flat. It was totally flat. Cody had to put the spare on, drive around for hours trying to find a place to have it repaired. Eventually, we got it repaired. Places are still close on Sunday. They do. A lot of they, places do. They were all, everywhere was closed. We ended up going to Walmart to get it fixed. And um, luckily, we found another hotel to stay in. We had to, you know, extend our stay. And eventually, we got home. So, you, you had to stay through Monday, come home on Monday. Came home on Monday. Because I texted you Sunday night to send you Riders Wednesday for Instagram and, and said, Hope you're home safe. And I didn't even answer because she we didn't just, even we answer. Home. So, that was my weekend. <laughs> Gosh, mine was chaos. Just, mine was just simple, easy going. I wish no, that was if, you. Mine, this is. Yeah, you know, I walk around. Excuse me, remember, <laughs> plunk, I walk around with a cane because my balance is bad. Uh -huh. And Sunday afternoon, we went to the movie. Uh huh. Oh no. Saw the movie. What happened? Came out. I was feeling so good, and there's a curve that, before you go into the parking lot. Uh -oh. no, and so Terry, my wife, said, "Let me get down, and you can hold on. You can put your hand on my shoulder and uh -huh. get down." I said, "I don't need that." Uh -huh. I've got my cane. Famous last words. Did you fall on the ground? I fell on the ground. Jackie. Did I you mean, hurt anything? I, I, I twisted. Uh-huh. You know, did not hit my head. That's Good. You know, when you're on blood thunders and everything, they were like, don't hit your head. Right. But, you know, but just, you know, sprawled out. Were you okay? You got up yeah. and you were able to go. Hey, look. You're good. You're I mean, good. Yeah. yeah. But... Just a little bump. Embarrassed. Yeah. And, but I will tell you, people came from everywhere. I Coming mean, to help. To, you know, let, wait, let, you know, are you all right? Let me help you get up. Blah, blah, blah. It was, so, that was, that was, but I was achy, uh -huh. you know, but I didn't hurt anything. Yeah, so, good. So that was. Well, we both had a bad weekend then. <laughs> well, that's how well, it is when that. you're 105 and 14. <laughs> <laughs> Man, maybe this weekend will be better. You know, I, Come back I, next week and find out. I, 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 I'm not even going to say, you know, did, uh, did you see a movie? I didn't. Did I, I didn't have time. You didn't have time. Come on this week. Come on. Uh, yeah. We'll try again next week. Because you were also, you told me, you said, while I'm up there, I've got to get some studying in. Mm -hmm. done. Some homework. Because you want to get everything done before, before my, Hawaii. Before my trip to Hawaii. I don't know if that's going to happen. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Well, don't be, I'm, don't I'm be anxious about and, it. I won't be anxious about it. We'll just put that thought somewhere else. But we hope that your, <laughs> your week has been great. Better than and, ours. And that <laughs> it's going to continue to be good. Listen, you know, even with bad weekends, I'm so thankful for my blessings. I don't know what Me to too. do. Me and you too. are too. Yeah. We both are. Yeah. But this has been Jackie K. Cooper here with Amber Howell. And this has been Tell All Tuesday.